Hi everyone, I have just arrived at my viewing spot here. Um, hope to get out the telescope, my new uh, Celestron telescope. I am on the north side of Lake Superior and uh, a town called Hovland. I'm north of Hovland, about 13 miles up the Arrowhead Trail. Uh, there is a overlook, quite a spectacular overlook as you can see. Uh, Portage Brook Overlook. And I'm gonna guess I'm uh, maybe 15 miles or so from Canada. Um, I'm hoping to, uh, Jupiter for sure I'm gonna see. I've got a couple of cameras. I got one uh, for planets, the other uh, for deep space. Nothing fancy, they're kind of low level cameras. I've had some success with them, but uh, if this works out, maybe I'll bite the bullet and get a, a couple of better cameras. But uh, so anyway, got some uh, stuff to set up and uh, let's see what I can do. All for now. Just had to get a, a shot at the sunset. It's gorgeous up here. Beautiful. I don't have my wedge built yet. Uh, I see some guys online or on YouTube uh, that's built some wedges for their their setup. Uh, so I don't have an equatorial mount. I probably won't be able to track real well. Um, we'll see what I can do. And as you can see, we've got the moon. All right, the sun has set, so. We'll get some stars coming up here shortly. Just had to take one more video of the sunset. Pretty spectacular. Also want to step back and just uh, review a couple of things here. Celestron Next Star 8 SE, so that's what I'm using. And then as far as the cameras go, nothing real fancy. Um, that next image 5, and then the all-in-one uh, astral cam. That's for uh, uh, more deep space uh, photography. So, all right, stars are out. I think I'm gonna start uh, aligning. All right, here's my first video of Jupiter. I got it overexposed so I can see some of the moons there. Probably can't see it so much from my uh, cell phone video here, but uh, hopefully I can get some pictures of it. 